All right, championship Saturday, and a champion is crowned. The Cal Baptist Lancers have just cut down the nets. CBU was absolutely magnificent from start to finish. What an absolutely dominating performance. Even their head coach, Rick Croy, did not see this coming, he said. 101 to 64 the final score. They led it 51 to 30 at halftime. They jumped out to a huge lead. I, th their run was something like 30 to four in the first half. They had it going on all cylinders, offensively, defensively. They had great scoring from Jerron Wilnight and then Michael Smith setting the all-time Pac West tournament scoring record with 92 points in three games. Both of them hit for 26. Wow, the Lancers were off. You know, seeing Jalon Wilwright um, and Michael Smith and all these guys last year, we saw them on a, the other side. And it's like, you can tell these guys went all year waiting for this moment, waiting for redemption, and they just attacked it. Sometimes coming through that and getting redemption is the ultimate prize. And this CBU Lancer team, they actually struggled a little bit at the beginning of the conference season. They were down at like fourth or fifth place. They had to come back to get into a first place tie. And then, wow, did they put it together in the tournament. And certainly no one saw this coming. APU had won two really close games against the Lancers during the regular season, and then, a game that was a total blowout. I mean, it was just like, name the score. 51 points in the first half, 50 in the second half. They hit nearly 60% of their shots. What a job, what a champion. And a championship game would be nothing without the crowd and the cheerleaders and the parents and the families. And just talk about this atmosphere in Irvine. Well, it was definitely a championship atmosphere. Thanks to the Cal Baptist Band also, for uh, helping set the tone. APU's band uh, also taking part in it. It was just a wonderful championship atmosphere. You can tell the crowd really got into it. Certainly when it's a lopsided score, it kind of, you know, you get half of the fans are not as cheering it quite as loudly. But at the end, when they cut down the nets, uh, for some of these players, it was the first time oh, yes. they had ever gone through an experience like that. And to actually get your little piece of twine <laughs> and then to feel right. the championship trophy. Right. What a moment that is, and the Lancers earned it. Well, now we move forward. I mean, some of our teams are gonna keep playing, not just our champions, and just talk about where we go from here. What does our conference have to look forward to? The NCAA West Regionals will take place next week. Certainly, APU and Cal Baptist are going to be in it. Uh, the question is, uh, will Dixie State join them? We won't be able to find that out until the selection show, which is Sunday evening. We're, of course, hoping that we'll get three in. We'll get at least two. And uh, you know, my hope, frankly, is I hope they don't play each other in the first round, but right. we won't know until that NCAA selection show. Well, congratulations to the CMU Lancers. They are Pac West champions in 2016. Yeah, man. That was good. Hard work paying off. We ain't done yet. We ain't done yet. Make our and that's kind of what played out today. We, we made great commitments to each other. Some of the best defense we played against a, a great APU team. Um, you know, we got a lot of respect for their program. They, they, they got great players, they got great chemistry, and um, we put together a real good performance today. So I'm proud of the guys.